I would like to introduce a partner in state economic development and a resource for local economic developers and attracting investors. Jobs Ohio is a private nonprofit corporation designed to drive job creation and new capital investment in Ohio. And at development, we work closely with Jobs Ohio when looking at opportunities that are best served with a balance of private investment and state and federal incentives. Jobs Ohio is committed to creating places in Ohio where companies can thrive and individuals can enjoy a higher standard of living. Their core values are designed to strengthen Ohio communities. Joining us today is Andrew Dye, Managing Director, to share how Jobs Ohio can be a partner in qualified opportunity zones. Welcome, Andrew. Good afternoon, everyone. Thank you for the opportunity to be here today. On behalf of JP Nassif, our new president and CIO, I want to applaud the collective effort underway to maximize impact and opportunity zones across the state. In particular, I want to thank Director Mahalik and her staff at the Development Services Agency for their leadership in organizing today's showcase. Ohio has the opportunity to be the national leader in leveraging opportunity zones. And with forums like this, the state is on its way to achieving that ambition. As Ohio's private economic development company, Job, Jobs Ohio continues to be inspired by our mission to attract jobs, companies, and investment to the state. We've now had the privilege of working on over 1,700 business investment projects across the state, and we certainly don't do that work alone. Continuing to operate in an integrated fashion with DSA, our six regional network partners, and local economic development partners across the cities and counties. That includes all of you here today. So whether it's Ohio City, Hamilton, Athens, Fostoria, Akron, Dayton, we have much to be impressed about. Jobs Ohio is aligned with Governor DeWine and Lieutenant Governor Husted's commitment to growing opportunity in every corner of the state. In the previous piece, the mayor of Dayton talked about the pieces of the puzzle. So what pieces of the puzzle can Jobs Ohio add to the effort? Jobs Ohio can meet, make at least three contributions here. First, outreach to institutional investors. Depending on the resource, there are between 75 and 250 Opportunity Zone funds out there. And as a matter of our business practice, we're in active dialogue with institutional investors across the country, and we'll continue to do so. Second, our corporate site selection portal. Um, in Q4 2018, this portal, which includes over 3,500 sites, was updated to reflect Opportunity Zone status. So for each site, it's tagged in or out of an Opportunity Zone alongside other zones such as Enterprise Zones and Ford Trade Zones. The third piece of the puzzle that we're continuing to build is Site Ohio. Growing the portfolio of greenfield industrial sites across the state continues to be an imperative for us. 18, states, or 18 sites across Clark, Claremont, Crawford, Fairfield, Fayette, Gallia, Green, Highland, Hocking, Licking, Richland, Union, Van Wert, Williams, and Wood counties are now available through the Site Ohio program. Eight of these 18 sites, eight of these 18 sites are in opportunity zones. So overall, we share the commitment to attracting investment to Ohio, and we look forward to taking this to the next level. As part of that effort, J.P. Nassif is visiting with each region of the state, with our regional partners and our local partners, to listen. Listen and understand where opportunities to strengthen our partnership exist. So Jobs Ohio will continue to do its pieces of the puzzle as we hope Ohio becomes a national leader in Opportunity Zones. Thank you.